Hello, YouTube. Uh, meet the Bible. I uh, appreciate you turning in. I, 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 I tell you, I, I want to address something here because I, I keep, for some reason, this is coming up more and more, and perhaps because I'm I'm beating up the rapture theory more and more. But let, let's let's go to First Thessalonians four sixteen. Four sixteen. A lot of confusion on this. Uh, the subject today is the dead in Christ shall rise first. Completely misunderstood, guys. For the Lord himself shall descend from heaven with a shout, with the voice of the archangel, and with the trump of God, and the dead in Christ shall rise first. Um, gosh, people. <laughs> okay, if we look into the word, if we go into the word, rise, and it's important because you, I mean, you have to understand the big photo and understand to get rise. But I went and looked this up. <laughs> um, the word in the Strong's Concordance is number 450. It's anastemi. Anastemi is the rise it's talking about. The rise it's talking about. And it means to rise, to stand up. Of persons lying down, of persons lying on the ground, of persons seated, of those who leave a place to go elsewhere, of those who prepare themselves for a journey. The root word, number Hebrew 2476, uh, is histema, is to cause or make to stand. To place, put, set, or stand, to kept in, to be kept intact of family, a kingdom, to escape in safe in safety. Well, that's one Thessalonians four sixteen, but back up a little bit more to one Thessalonians four fourteen. For we believe Jesus died and rose again. Even so them also which sleep they're dead that died in jesus jesus will bring with him all right so <laughs> all right nobody's in the ground nobody's in no the, you know when this clay body is done carrying this this, this vessel is done carrying the holy spirit and we die we instantly return to the father who made us okay instantly that's uh, uh, First Corinthians uh, uh, five eight, and uh, Ecclesiastes twelve six and seven. We instantly return to the Father who made us. Okay, so all spirits are in heaven. It says here in in First Thessalonians four fourteen that those who died in Christ are going to come with him. In order to come with them, we're in spirit bodies in heaven. We rise. We stand up. We leave the fort. Kind of like, a, you know, the cavalry in the old days. And then and military today, even today, when, when you know, I've been many a send-off where at the airport, they, they people come out of respect to see us off. The cavalry going out to fight the Indians. And the, the people in support, probably the Indians, didn't stand up. <laughs> but the the dead and the dead the excuse me in the fort the the support of the cavalry stood up in respect for the soldiers going to battle remember there's a little armageddon five minute battle when jesus returns the dead in christ rising has nothing to do with dead people in the ground it absolutely has nothing the dead in christ people who've died in and gone to heaven in a, in a different class but everybody dies goes to heaven but on the right side of God are Christians and their team Jesus okay they all the saints come with Jesus all of them the dead in Christ are those who have died and gone to heaven in Christ okay if I die tomorrow I'm in heaven I'm in Christ's name okay so I and, and I hope to be one of the warriors he brings back with him so I, I just had to address this misconcept of the word rise. Um, you're, you're either born on Team Satan or you come to Team Jesus. All right, guys. 
and and I want to stress that and time's running out I think it's more important than ever to subscribe and get this word out um, like if, if you do like but we really uh, time's running out we need to get this the truth out um, and this misconception of bodies in the ground there's no such thing as a rapture nobody's flying anywhere if we're gonna go anywhere it's, it's to the barn in Matthew 1330 okay that's where we're gonna go because we're gonna meet Jesus with, with all the saints he brings with him in the clouds but it's a cloud of witnesses and we're gonna fly over to Jerusalem which is the barn and we're gonna you know, rule with him for a thousand years but anyways I just wanted to put that small out small uh, bit of information out God bless now team Jesus thanks come back Bye.